pretty difficult to uh, have an opening statement because it's been a while since we played a game like that. So not a very good feeling. Um, they beat us in all phases. Um, you know, I thought physically they played extremely hard. Um, we didn't match the intensity. Felt like we got pushed around. We were not able to run the ball. They ran the ball. They made competitive plays, outcoached us, outplayed us in every area. So overall, just a very deflating victory, uh, uh, defeat. You know, they kicked our butts. Questions? Josh Moore, go ahead. Hey, Mark. What, I know you shook up the routine. Did I mean, I don't know. I guess start with Will, with with him. What was what was up tonight? It just seemed like he never was really on um, you yeah, know, most of the game. He, he was definitely not comfortable. I think they, you know, do a nice job of mixing some things up. I thought he went back to uh, pressing, rushing uh, some things, uh, forcing, forcing the issue right from early in the game. So, uh, you know. It's not just him. We didn't play very good anywhere. John Hale. Mark, I think you said on your radio show earlier this week that you thought they had learned from that Chattanooga game what happens when you have a, a letdown performance. Was this more of that, or was that some? Was there something else going on tonight? I, I really don't know. It's hard to put my finger on it. Um, I felt like we had good preparation. I felt, you know, I think uh, you have to give them credit. They, they were very physical. You, we knew that coming into it. You know, you look at their defense and the, the way they mix it up, the way they put pressure on you. Um, you know, I knew that coming into it, and uh, they did. And, um, you know, and then for us, um, you know, on the other side of the ball, for us defensively, just completely didn't make uh, – didn't seem like we made one competitive play, at least down the field. You know, some of our guys up front – uh, maybe did some good things, but uh, anytime they throw as efficiently as they did, um, you know, they ran it just enough to keep us off balance, but uh, they moved the chains. And, you know, when you give up what we have four turnovers, when you have to turn the ball over like that against the an offense uh, like this and on the road, you got no shot. So um, just overall, no good across the board. Larry Vaught. Mark, did it surprise you the lack of physicalness by your defense? It seemed like they, the Mississippi State ran through a lot of tackles or just ran by your guys an awful lot tonight. Yeah, it did. It did. Uh, very frustrating. And uh, I just said that to the team that, uh, you know, that's um, very uncharacteristic and that's not going to happen. We may lose, uh, you know, we may get beat, but. Uh, I didn't like the intensity that we played with, the physicality that we played with. I felt like we were pushed around, and uh, that's not a good feeling. Derek Terry. Mark, you guys rotated a lot of defensive guys in, you know, even early in the game. Guys maybe haven't played a ton of snaps this year. Was, was that just matchup based or some other reason for that? Yeah, we, we just, uh, we're, you know, getting really thin. You know, we're getting really thin, and uh, uh, some of it was matchup. Um, you know, with, you know, putting JJ in there inside and um, just bodies in uh, and Jordan Wright got hurt. Uh, I don't know. I think it was the first half, but uh, just getting thin. John Clay. Mark, uh, Chris Rodriguez with the fumbles. Is he dealing with anything physically or do you think it just gotten into his head at this point? Uh, he was dealing with something this week, um, but no excuses. Um, you know, I think uh, with the fumble, there was a combination of things on that play. We got blown up at tackle, uh, you know, pressure in the backfield. The handoff looked a little high, but uh, not very good. Josh Moore. Mark, with their quarter, sorry if you can't hear me, but with the quarterback, their quarterback, I mean, I know some of the one-on-one the -on -one stuff there and the tackles, and, but was there anything in particular that he was doing besides, you know, I mean, his completion rate, I mean, it was really high. 
Yeah, it was uh, exceptionally high. Um, you know, I did a really nice job of, of you know, holding in the pocket. He hit uh, just enough uh, down the seams uh, to hurt us with some explosives. And then uh, they did a really nice job of hitting some uh, some check downs and running through us, you know, physically there on the perimeter as well. John Hale. Mark, at halftime on the broadcast, Mike Leach said that you guys were simulating their snap count, which was the reason for all the false starts. Was there anything to that? Uh, no, you're not allowed to simulate their, their snap count. Larry Vaught. Yeah, talk a little about the, the, the punt return that Josh Ali had, but but then he wasn't much of a factor in, in the passing game. What was the reason for that, Mark? Well, um, you know, it's hard to put your finger on it why he wasn't uh, more of a factor in the past game. I think, you know, as I mentioned this week, coming back, um, you know, you'd like to see him be at full tilt, uh, but uh, anytime you're coming back from a knee injury and you're playing wide receiver, I think it's hard to be at full speed and have that complete 100% trust, um, you know, in the first game back. Hopefully he'll feel better and better. I need to probably watch the film there, Larry, to get a more accurate uh, assessment of his play at wide receiver. Uh, but that was certainly a big play for us early with the punt return, and I knew we would need it, um, you know, some, some, you know, plays. And certainly we needed some uh, turnovers, and we didn't get that this year. Um, and, uh, you know, with that offense, you got to have, you know, uh, some stops, you know, get a tip, get a deflection, get a strip. We didn't get any of that. But the punt return helped. And then, uh, obviously, on the other side of the ball, I was turning it over, giving to them a uh, very, very uh, bad combination there. John Wong. Mark, on the fourth down, when you decided to kick it, that stopped them all day. What was going through your mind in terms of that decision? Uh, wasn't ready to give up at that point. I mean, you know, we try to get a stop and, you know, uh, nothing, nothing really worked, John. At that point, if we give it up, then it's a complete give up. You know, if we don't get the first down, it's over. Nick? The air raid, quote unquote, actually outran you all. What went wrong uh, in the rushing game, both offensively and defensively? Uh, they were more physical than us. You know, they uh, ran it uh, 35 times. You know, that's, that's definitely probably uh, a record, you know, for Mike in his time at uh, – Mississippi State, but a lot of that had to do with the game. They were killing the clock late and running it effectively, keeping us off balance. Um, you know, we didn't have a lot of good answers. So, um, you know, they did they did a lot better job and they were a lot more physical. So uh, for us, you know, we didn't have a lot of plays. You know, when you're turning it over that many times, when we're letting them possess the ball, uh, it's just, uh, again, uh, put it all together and it's it's not very good. John Clay. Mark, as you said, it's been a while since you've had a game like this. How do you want this particular team to react to that, react to this this coming week? Do you want them to be angry? Do you want them to put their heads down and just go back to work? How do you want it? What do you want to see this week? Well, I mean, we have to address it. You know, we just did. I mean, that's not a good feeling. And uh, I don't, I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to have a football team like this. And I don't think these guys want to play that way. Um, you know, that's not who we're going to be. That's not going to be our identity. And, uh, you know, we'll get back to work and get it fixed and make sure we get the right guys out on the field that uh, want to continue to play like we play. John Wong. Mark, you're usually very good at predicting how your team is going to come out. You said how great a week of practice they had. Was there any indication? at all that they would pull the stud? No, I think um, it's how you react. You know, we have an opportunity to come out. We go ahead 10-0 uh, and feel like you're playing decent. And then, uh, you know, the wheels come off with turnovers and not moving the ball. And bad things happen, and it's how you react to it. And we didn't react to it very good. 